I'm going to cook chicken with garlic and rosemary. Please look the weather. I can't believe it. Cooking a storm with a storm. What can I do more than that? <laughs> Don't be afraid. I'm here. You're going to enjoy it because I'm enjoying so much. It's such a simple dish to do. Three ingredient maximum flavor. One kilogram of drumstick and thigh. First, you have to cut in chunks, right? One, use everything. If you can't use your hands, use a rolling pin. Come on, come on. My soul to jump in and make sure the skin is on. Lovely sometimes to have a nice bit of skin. You got all this straight in. I love cooking this weather. I just love it. This is the pieces. I've turned the other way around. One, which is good. Two. Now you need four pieces. Turn them around. And look at that. Fantastico. Fantastico. All right. And over the plate. Now this is come to the best. Salt. Use a salt which you can feel it. Sea salt. Look at that. I can count it almost every single one. And you put that all in it. Grab a bit of peppers. It's not that very fine like a like a sand dust. You know, gross, you can see. Get your hands and mix it. Mix it, mix it, mix it. You make sure the salt goes everywhere. You don't have to do anything goes. Stay there, don't move. Saucepan is out. Olive oil. It's fantastic, it's good for you. I can hear the bell. Tell me to hurry up. Olive oil goes in. And a little splash of water. Make everything splash. Then, you get the chicken. Put them inside, already season it. Stir it. Ah, yeah. Keep it stirring and get the lovely color. Garlic. Open the garlic. Look at that. Oh my, my. Oh my, my. Come on, you try to stop me cooking. You can't. Crush the garlic with your hands and leave everything, even the skin. You need to put one kilo, one, two, three, four, five, six. And rosemary, this is how much rosemary you're gonna get it. Cut it. One, two, three, four. Garlic and rosemary, you need some nice chili. Couple of chili, that should be okay. It's all there. Look at that. Let me just put something on the front. Yeah. Start to seal it, start to come really nice. At this stage, when it's nice and sealed, get a garlic and you can see the garlic. Put them on top. Everywhere. Don't be afraid. Look, I'm gonna put another two. Now you come to the rosemary. One, two, three, and four. And for the chili, it's quite strong, so just use two chili, which leave them all. You can see I left it. Put them on top. Okay. Wash your hands like I do it. I just was born just around the corner. That is right at the end. Now, at this stage, turn the gas low and cover it with the lid. Make sure it's well covered. And let it cook slowly, slowly for about 35 minutes. Now and again, go in and make sure it won't stack, it won't burn. Okay, take a look. It is ready. It cooked very, very slow. 
Now I turn the gas right high because I'm going to put the wine inside. Oh my, my, look at the colour. Come near and hear this noise. Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh my, my, look at that. It's become almost creamy. I made some fantastic bruschette. Bruschette is a slice of rustic bread which are griddled and are going to wrap some garlic on top and drizzle with olive oil. I kept very warm on the cloth. There it is. I'm going to check my umbrella away, my lucky umbrella. And this is the bread with so much love and passion. Look at that. Now I get a nice bit of garlic, never mind about the skin, and I wrap every single one just a little bit on top to get a full flavour. Yes, yes. It is ready because I can see the oil start to come up. The wine is all evaporated. This is hot. Wow. Yes, turn the gas off. Come on. Slowly, I will put it a few pieces at a time on each bruschetta. There it goes. Oh, yes. This is chicken with the garlic and rosemary with a splash wine. If you want to see me do more dishes, don't forget Jamie Oliver, Food Channel, YouTube, and I will show you so many different ones. Enjoy it. <laughs>